And so I got the question the other day in the email, and the question was simply this. What bank do you select when going to the Dominican Republic, as well as what criteria should you use when trying to figure out which bank you're going to use? And I'm going to answer that question today right here on Dominican Rendezvous. But before we do, I just want to say once again, thank you to all the subscribers who are taking me up to uh, that magic number that I need to be at at some point. And I want to say thank you for those of you who have been sending comments, who have been liking, and as well to those of you who have been sharing this video channel with others. I do appreciate it. I appreciate your support. And I will continue to give you content as possible. So let's get right into today's subject, selecting your bank in the Dominican Republic. One of the big questions after you have decided to relocate to the Dominican Republic will be which bank to choose and how to select that particular bank. Now, in another video, if you go back and you go back into some of the videos that I've done before, I do talk about money and banking in the various banks in the Dominican Republic. I won't take the time in this video at this stage to go over each one of those banks, but what I am going to encourage you to do is to go back and look at that video, as well as do your research online, or if you're in the country, go into the various banks in the uh, cities where you're located and ask some questions uh, and get some research done fast and first and foremost um, when looking for the bank that you're going to choose. Read up on the various banks. See what they have to offer. You can go online, hit their websites. Uh, sometimes they will have the website translated into English if you need English, but certainly it will be there in Spanish, of course. And then, of course, you can ask around. Ask around to other people that you know what banks they're using, uh, what banks they recommend, and why. Ask the questions. Check out the bank. Get the information as much as you can about the bank. And now once you've narrowed it down to one or two banks, go and visit those banks would be my, uh, ex my advice. And as you go in, ask a lot of questions at the bank. Ask about the safety of your accounts and your deposit. How are they uh, uh, going to be insured and how they are uh, insured? Ask about transaction fees that you may incur and maintenance fees that you may incur uh, in the process of banking at that particular bank. One of the other things that you really want to ask about are international and bank transfers. How is money transferred? How do you... Um, uh, do online banking as well, as well as if there are any fees attached to it. In most cases, there, there may be. Now, fourthly, what I would also suggest to you to do is to make sure that they do have someone there at your local branch at the bank uh, that speaks uh, English, if English is your native language and you're not uh, fully um, uh, fluent in, in Spanish. You want to make sure somebody there who can speak English can help you at any moment that you may need help when you visit the bank. And then lastly, what I would suggest to you is to ask about credit. Ask about credit. Ask them what kind of credit they offer, uh, what are the terms, what are the transaction fees that are associated to using credit, uh, how you can get a card. Those are the types of things that you want to ask. Now, be prepared to be turned down for credit simply because in most cases, your credit history will not transfer into the Dominican Republic. And if they do give you credit, be prepared for higher interest fees that are charged to those accounts. And so those are just some quick tips as I answer that question. How do you select a bank or how do you go about selecting a bank in the Dominican Republic? I hope it's helpful for you. If you have any questions, feel free to email me at mjfresh 44 at gmail.com or at Dominican Rendezvous dot at gmail.com. Thank you very much for joining the channel today. I appreciate your time. Look forward to seeing you again.